know everyone out there is wanting to know what's the latest with the rain situation. For those of you who need to get to work this morning, we're going to bring you up to date on any uh, street flooding and closures you need to know about. We're starting off our team coverage this morning with Sunrise reporter Chelsea Torres. Chelsea, tell us exactly where you are this morning and what you're seeing. Good morning, everybody. I'm over here at Port and Crosstown. I'm going to move out of the way a little bit. What you can see right here is a stalled car underneath the overpass way on the other side of Crosstown. And this car over to the right, uh, this maroon type SUV, they were starting to go. They had already been underneath the overpass and they were going to try to keep going, but decided to turn around, went straight onto the grass, and now they are stuck. Um, as you can see right now, this entire area is just getting flooded. And it, this will happen, and I'm not lying, this will happen just in the past two hours. This is what can happen, people, if you're not paying attention. Now, mind you, this area of Port and Crosstown is actually barricaded. So if you're going towards downtown from Crosstown and you try to exit Port, you will see those barricades. So all of these people are coming through past the barricades. If you see the barricades up, please just pay attention, turn around, do not try to go past it. Um, again, on the other side of uh, Port where Crosstown is, there are no barricades over there, so there have been a lot of stalled vehicles. There's been a lot of stalled vehicles, a lot of we've already seen um, people abandon their vehicles and have to get rescued out of there uh, just by other people pulling them in. We've seen other people uh, get pulled with their vehicles from other vehicles. So this is what we're dealing with right now. And again, just remember that if you see an area that looks flooded and it may not seem as flooded, just turn around, don't drown. That's really the name of the game this morning.